Hey everyone, my name's Braden. We're going to go over how to get your Excel data into a pandas data frame. Specifically, we're going to go over how to read in a single sheet from your Excel workbook, multiple sheets at the same time, and how to create a single data frame from your multiple sheets at the same time. So I've created an Excel workbook that has three sheets in it, sheet one, two, and three, which is a custom name. Each Excel sheet contains three columns and a row that corresponds to what sheet it is in. So this row has ones for sheet one, this row has twos for sheet two, and the custom sheet has threes for the third sheet. We can get started by importing pandas as PD. And we will create our first data frame. We'll call it sheet one. And we will read in our Excel data. The data is called cooldata.xlsx. And when you want to just read in the first sheet, you don't have to specify anything else other than this. If this is your first time using Excel with Python, you'll probably get the following error. Import error, missing optional dependency, XLRD. We can fix this problem with a quick pip install. So pip install XLRD. And now we'll go back to our data frame and rerun this. And we've read our first sheet. If you want to read in a specific sheet from Excel other than the first sheet, then we can do so easily. We'll just copy this first bit of code here and we'll call it sheet two and specify the sheet name. We can either put in the name of the sheet. So we want sheet two or what we can do is specify the index. So it would be index one that's because sheet one here is index zero, index one, and index two, and that would continue on for however many sheets you have in your workbook. So we'll read that in, and we have our second workbook read in. The process is exactly the same if we had our own custom worksheet name. We'll call this data frame custom, and sheet name is equal to custom name that corresponds to this custom name here that we renamed our sheet and we can view our custom data frame so we have that third sheet read in or the custom name we can also read in all of our sheets at the same time we'd follow the same procedure as before pd read excel Cool data. This time for sheet name, we're going to say none. And that will return a dictionary for us with all of our worksheets included. So we see here sheet one, sheet two, and our custom named sheet are all returned. If we want to access that, we can do so just like we would any other dictionary. So all sheets is our dictionary name. And then we would specify what sheet we want to look at. And there we go. We can also save that as a data frame here. And that will give us back the sheet one. If we wanted sheet two, we could say sheet two or our custom name will give us our custom named data frame back. If you're wanting to concatenate all of your sheets together, you can. There are three conditions we want to follow if we're going to do that. First, we want to make sure that there are no duplicate data across the sheets. We want to make sure that the column names are the same and you are using all the sheets. What we'll do is we'll create a data frame called concat 
pick cell and we will say pd concat pd read excel and we'll read in our excel data for sheet name we'll say none and then ignore index is equal to true so what this will do is return a data frame where all the sheets are stacked on top of one another. We can see that here where each column, column one, two, and three, has the data from our first sheet and from our second sheet and our third sheet. If you have any other questions about how to get your Excel data into Pandas, Leave a comment below and I'll get back to you. Otherwise, thanks for watching.